Someone said, don't ask what your country can do for you. Ask what you can do for your country. This is a long phase. When you don't know what you're going to say, this is going to buy some time. <laughs> so it's a good day to remember. Someone said, Newton's fourth law. Do any of you know who Newton is? Anyone yes. learn science? <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Only you raise your hand. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> you Newton. So how many laws do Newton actually have? Three. Three. <laughs> so why do we have a Newton? <laughs> that means there's something that doesn't exist. It's a really good use of language. It's the same as people saying that they go to pay golf and then they're gonna hit the hole number 19 because uh, playing golf only has 18 holes. <laughs> Someone said, let's keep the momentum going. That's a really good use of language. He, he actually asked whether you're uh, enjoying the uh, meeting or not, and let's keep the momentum going. I think that's a very good reaching sentence for, for the next uh, speaker. Someone said he's a wanderer. Someone said he's a wanderer. So, He's kind of like a very romantic drifter that drift around. I like that particular word. I, as I can remember, someone said, uh, there are some people who have similar ideas. He, he moves around different countries. And then he said, uh, I don't know what I'm gonna, where I'm going to go. Let the wind takes me. Wow, that's so romantic. <laughs> Wendell is also a romantic term. Someone said, maximize benefit and minimize the cause. Uh, actually, the evaluator has already mentioned that. Make the most value of your time. This is really uh, effective pronunciation, effective communication of language. Actually, I think most people will agree with her when she says, make the most of use of your time. Uh, someone said, devoid of emotion. Devoid of emotion. Actually. I don't know how I pronounce that word. How should I pronounce that word? Anyone can tell me that? It's true. Uh, I it's mean, correct. How do you, how, how do you, how do you uh, 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 actually spell? How is that spell? Yeah. D-E-O-I-D. D-E-O-I-D. V-O-I-D? Okay, okay. It's a new word for me. I, I, I know how to pronounce it. I don't know how to <laughs> Okay, so right now I remember a phrase, devoid of emotion. And someone said attention grabbing. I think it's the same as as attention catching. Mm -hmm. So attention grabbing is another uh, uh, phase that you can use. Someone said, will be do, will be do by. I think it's a, it's a wrong grammar. It should be, will be done by. It should be, will be done by. Someone repeated it several times, but uh, he's been in the meeting for such a long time. He actually conducted the whole meeting, so I think <laughs> he said, so and the topic is, so and the topic is. Actually, those words are really redundant. So the topic is, well, the word so is actually redundant. And he said, so and the topic is, is redundant and redundant. <laughs> uh, I think that concludes my. <laughs>